Hi, this is Rockin' Robin. Welcome to Rockin' Robin's Garage Sale Finds, the YouTube channel that helps resellers make more money. Now today I wanna to talk about categories, eBay categories in particular. You're on eBay and you choose the wrong category and you don't even realize it. What does that mean? Is it going to be bad for you? Well, yes it is. I often will go to a flea market and I'm selling at the flea market and some from time to time I'll go and I'll find something. And let's say one time I found this uh, cologne and it was a dollar and I looked it up and it was selling for $30, $40 online and they were selling all day long. So I wanted to put it right up. So I scanned it like I showed you how to scan in one of my videos. I scanned it and I put it right up. Well, I thought, geez, you know, in case I don't have a good day flea marketing, at least when I get at home I know that that's gonna sell well I had it in the wrong category and it did not sell and I was like I got home I didn't realize I was like what is going on why didn't this sell they're selling like crazy and I had mine reasonably priced I think I had mine at 31 and they're selling average at 35 to 40 so I figured oh, I'd make money well, you gotta have them in the right category. And if you're not paying attention or you don't put it in the right category, sometimes it just does not sell. People don't understand that categories are important on eBay. Now I'm gonna show you a few examples of ones that I did and things you should do and some tips and secrets. I love to give you tips and secrets. So we're gonna do that today. So if this is your first time here, we sell on eBay and we've been selling for over 20 years on eBay. We have so much experience. We sell on Mercari, new kind of to that, only like two or three years now, but I love it. We sell on Poshmark, we sell on Facebook Marketplace, and of course, I sell at the flea market. You stay with us. We are gonna talk about categories. Okay, so today we're gonna talk about the importance of choosing the right category. Well, here you go. We're gonna look up some Harley Davidson t-shirt men's and see what categories they give us. Now, they will show you a whole bunch of different examples and you can say, well, do I want one of those? Or should I hit create my own listing? I always press the create a new listing because I wanna be sure it's not exactly the same. Then you go in and they'll say t-shirts, clothing, men's shoes, accessories. Well, I want something more detailed. That was what they would pick. I wanna look at what else is suggested. There are several other different kinds that you can choose from. And I wanna choose, of course, the one that says Harley Davidson. Right there, it says transportation, motorcycles, Harley Davidson t-shirts. That would be the proper one. They would have just given you t-shirts, which wouldn't have gotten you as many views. Now I'm gonna put here New Green Bay Packers hats, and I spelled it wrong on purpose, just to see what they give you. Now they didn't give me anything, but eventually when they gave me a category, it was NFL football, and that was okay for me. Sometimes you'll get the right ones even when you do the wrong thing, but here you can see some of the other samples that they could have put yours in. Stamps, clothing, girls, hats, clothing, one pieces. You know, you could have gotten into one of those because they just put it into whatever category they feel. We were lucky we would have gotten the right one. But you have to look and make sure you don't get those wrong ones. Now here is pen set. Now you have a lot of different ways you could do pen set but you need to put more specifics you can't just put pen set is it a calligraphy pen set is it a cross pen set what kind of pen set it is and then they'll give you all the choices and you get to choose specifically which one was the right one to put it in you could have so easily done it wrong so you gotta give a lot of specifics to be sure you're getting the right one. You need to get the right category because a lot of people will buy stuff just using categories. Now look at this one. We're gonna look at this bobblehead. And this is something that I have up. And let's see if I have it in the right category, if I could find something better. Presently, it is in the collectibles, pins, bobbleheads, lunch boxes, and that's not bad. But when I look down at the other ones available, look i find one that says sports and has bobbleheads that's an even better category for me to choose than just the typical bobbleheads so you got to change it to that and chances are if people are looking just through that category now they're going to see that one before they wouldn't have seen it because i picked 
the wrong one. So I changed it and I put it into the sports category. That is a better choice because you need to be sure you have it in the right ones. People don't realize how important categories are, but those are some of the things you could do to get in the right categories. I advise you to take your time when you choose your category. Okay, so welcome back. I hope that helps you. If you have any questions about categories, please don't hesitate to leave me a comment because I always want to help you. I can't always, some people leave comments sometimes and I can't help them, but if I can, I will. Like I said, I've been doing this for 20 years, so I know more than I want to know. So I want you now, if you like our channel, please subscribe because we want to help you in any way we can. We want you to be successful on eBay, on Mercari, on any of the formats that we sell, anything we can do to help you become successful. Next, I want you to give us a thumbs up. Thumbs up means you like us and that helps the algorithm for us on YouTube. And also, if you hit the bell, then you're notified when we have our next video and that video might be able to help you make more money. Yeah, that's what I'm, our goal is always here to help you make more money. So what I want you to do now is I want you to put something up, check the category, go through the categories, make sure you have the right category. Maybe you want to spend the day going through some of your old arms that you have listed and make sure they're in the right categories. And then I want to see, does it make a difference? Did it make a difference for you? Let me know in the comments. Then I want you to go make yourself some money. I'll see you soon with a brand new tips, secrets, strategies, whatever.